Hey everybody, I'm Jason with Daylight Down. Thank you guys so much for the support here in Houston. We've got a lot of really good stuff coming up this year and next. Today, I'm going to run through a few solos uh, for some of the songs we're doing. I'll play them uh, by themselves and I'll play them in the song. And uh, we'll talk a little bit about gear and that kind of thing. So here's the solo for Weakness Bleeding. solo for shadows in the sun. Okay, now the solo for Demon You Love is really kind of, technically it's a solo, but it was something I had fully intended on rewriting. Um, there was something that uh, was just improvised when I wrote the song so that um, something would be in there to kind of let you know, here's where I want to put something cool. Um, showed the demo version of the song to the guys and they loved it and I told them I wanted to rewrite the solo and they were like, no, just leave it, it's cool. So, uh, here's what you get. Okay, I want to take a quick minute to uh, talk about tone. Um, I was a huge Mesa fan and still am. Um, I used a Triaxis and a 290 forever um, and love it. I still have them. I fairly recently got into the uh, Fractal Axe FX2 and uh, dug it because I could get all the tones from my Triaxis, which got all the tones from the 2C pluses and the Mark IVs and that kind of thing. So, um, really, really dig it. I love it for recording, for uh, recording direct for a reamping, um, even record bass tracks through it sometimes. Um, so it's a great piece. Um, live, it's great because you can plug directly into the front of house. They give you a monitor mix, and that's cool. Or you can still, um, you know, amp it up. I use a a, a Matrix GT1000 um, now uh, with two. Uh, I think that the oversized <laughs> rectal cabs. It might be the traditional. I'm not sure. But uh, anyway, we just, we really, really dig it. So my main guitar is this custom 24 Paul Reed Smith. Um, I also use an Ernie Ball Music Man, uh, the John Petrucci uh, JP-13. It's a great guitar, super fast neck. Um, it's got uh, a little hotter pickups than this. So uh, for, for a shredding, of course, and for some of the heavier songs we do, I usually go to that. Um, I also have a, a uh, Torero 
um, Paul Reed Smith and a, uh, a Paul Reed Smith Tremonti. Um, I don't use it a whole lot, but uh, but it's also a really cool guitar. I was an Ibanez guy forever. I used to love super thin necks because I used to play lots of, you know, the typical guitar stuff. Uh, back in the day, Yngwie and Steve Vai and all those cool guys. Um, uh, Nuno Betancourt is a huge influence for me. Um, John Petrucci, of course, is a huge influence, although you can't really tell it necessarily from Daylight Down songs. Every now and then you'll hear a little or, uh, or kind of feel a little bit of a... Of a uh, you know, Dream Theater vibe, but uh, um, musical influences outside of the guitar, um, as you can probably guess, it's kind of uh, you know Breaking Benjamin, of course. Uh, Chevelle was a was a good influence on us too. Um, lots of stuff, and that's just me. I mean, uh, the guys in the band have lots of other influences. You can kind of hear all of that in there. Um, the biggest thing for tone, though, for us, is uh, these very special. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, very special daylight down picks. This one's a little warm because I use it a lot. But uh, when I got these, it brought my playing to a whole other level. Um, I mean, I don't have any other guitar picks here to show you, but uh, you know, with other guitar picks, it was like bink, 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 and just kind of, kind of, <laughs> kind of embarrassing. But I passed these out to the guys, and boom, everything kind of just fell into place. So, uh, tell you what, if you uh, friend us on Facebook, send us a quick message, we'll send you some of these and you can see what you think, uh, see what it does for your playing, or even if you're not a player, just come out and collect them. They, I, I hear just having them in your pocket makes you, you know, a little more awesome. But uh, anyway, there's that, and uh, um, look us up on uh, DaylightDown.com, come out to the shows, we've got some at Scout Bar coming up, uh, BFE and Acadia coming up. Um, and I think we've got some stuff set for us, some surrounding cities, too. We'll get into that uh, on those pages. So find us on Facebook, uh, Twitter, Instagram, all those good places. And uh, we'll see you at the shows.